Hey, people. I'm going to pull out some of my messages first and see what kind of energy we pick up. If you're new to my channel, welcome to Pound Star Oracle. I hope I can give you a message today. Uh, viewer, viewer who views my channel. Somebody is saying, who the heck are you to try and tell me how to live my life? I choose to live in the light energy. Oh, is what you're saying to somebody? People trying to tell you how to live, and you're like, I choose to live in the light. You expose people. That's what it means, okay? These people don't like it. You're living in the light energy. Your angels will surround you and lead you away from people who will harm you. So remember to be grateful. Say, I'm grateful for you angels for leading me away from these people. The angels led you to the light energy. A true woman believes her man when he speaks to her. She's filled with goodness and grace and practices forgiveness with her unwavering faith. A poem by me, Pamela. Oh, there's some lesbians that watch your readings and they're sending sexual energy to you. So you'll be wanting women instead of men. So now I'm putting this out here. I don't know who you guys is, you guys, but I do love my old man, can you tell? You could have missed out on a business opportunity from the divine because this other person was budding in your business to slow you down. So there's somebody butting in your business trying to slow you down. Who is this? A lot of purple's coming out. This is about your crown chakra. Your crown chakra is open because, you know, you're rising up to become a leader in your community to show others the way to success. That's what we're, we're doing over here. We're trying to be successful in our business. That's what we're doing. Okay, you guys, what about don't tell us how to live our life. We choose to live in the light. What about that? What's that mean, Spirit? We choose to live in the light. Oh, because you've matured to this beautiful, centered person who's blossomed into full awareness of the gifts that you bring to others. Look, you're a beautiful lotus flower. And I love you guys, and I hope that you'll hit subscribe and help me. And you're grateful to these angels for uh, letting you be aware that somebody was digging up stuff from the past about you. And this person is amazed by the transformation that you went through. Look. So you transformed, I mean, you know, maybe somebody rejected you and, and it really messed with you and, and what you did is you turned you turned into becoming a leader in your community. People was rejecting you. A bunch of people was in a community to me, you know what I mean? Because I chose to live in a lot. You know, but that's okay because all it did is made me fuel me to be able to go after my goals and dreams, and I know I will, because that's how you transmute, that's how you transform all that energy, are you listening, and, and I did go through a total transformation, and I believe my man when he speaks, and uh, what else, what about a true woman boys her man, after all you put me through, I've learned to put energy into myself, see, this is what a lot of women did out here. That, uh, may, that maybe didn't have men that believed in you, you know, in her, but uh, you put your put energy to yourself. And your friend tried to have you set up, but you're good with yourself. And this friend is now getting, is now going down for selling coke in your friend circle. And maybe they did it at their work too. Huh? Maybe his friend paid some lesbian tarot reader to to make you miss out on opportunities. Maybe they told them to launch, latch into your channel like I'm telling you they did me. Yeah, yeah. If somebody's being blackmailed by this person, they're gonna try to blackmail you because you're not letting them buddy in your business anymore and trying to slow you down. And you're rising up to be a leader in the community and this could be your your buddy and their aunt could be involved. Auntie B, Auntie B, see you rise up to be a success and we have a lot of energy. You blossomed to this beautiful person, and they was somebody that was manipulating the situation, and they act like they didn't, you know? And and your angels steered you away from that person, so remember to be grateful. Like, be grateful, okay, because they steered you away from it. 
and they was trying to fit themselves in your life and in a situation that didn't even pertain to them. And and the, and they went around digging up shit, and everybody around sees that you changed, and you're a true woman, and you believe your old man, and after all these people put you through, you learn to put energy into yourself, and you know it's safe for you to love uh, this person you're inquiring on today. You, you all know whoever you're all inquiring on, they, they they must love you, you know, and they know that you was with maybe somebody that put you through things. And uh, they sent some lesbians to watch you, and it could have been your friend, did it? And it, and you saying, hey, uh, when you're healed, you ain't with these shallow SOBs anymore. And you don't care about missing a business opportunity and, because you know they're, they're trying to blackmail you. And it says God is good. And there are a lot of things that God shows you and you weren't supposed to tell others of because he chose his child to show you how he works. And I love you, God, because you did do that. And I thank you. And you taught me how to be a success. And I thank you. And there was an aunt to be and Uncle Buck. Oh, look at our aunt. An aunt and uncle doing it to you. Somebody's aunt and uncle out here was manipulating uh, this situation some way or another. All because you're just trying to be a, a leader in the community. And uh, th they didn't want you to have public status. You know, mid-heaven, this is what's in your tent, in your in your uh, birth chart. But this was about your life goals during your adult years. Uh, this provides an understanding of the essence of your character. They, they knew what your character was because they knew what was in your tenth house. And... And, and now you're telling all these people, toxic people, they ain't even loud around me or my energy. No, uh-uh. And if you're with people that never sees your point of view, how are you ever going to make your side of the story be heard? You can't. You can't. And give yourself time to be single and alone and get to know what you truly want for yourself. Somebody needs to do that out here. Maybe that's what people's telling me, that, I'm a, that I might be around toxic. Oh, and it's siblings that's telling this. It's siblings. Sibling rivalry. It's, it's an aunt and an uncle, and it's your brother and sister. It's got kids, is what that means. And, 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 and it's saying this person's cried ever since you walked out of their lives. It could be these siblings. And maybe some siblings out here hired a hitman to come after you. And, uh, you know, but... Uh, divine beings can feel exactly who I was involved. You crazy bunch of greedy asses. Aunt and uncle like figures in in our lives with with uh, younger people around trying to kill you. That's what it means. And somebody was planning something sneaky behind you back. Like to leave you high and dry. Without a word to you. Maybe you're... Maybe he's, maybe these brothers and sisters is telling you damn husband shit and that he was going to walk off. But it says don't compare yourself to other people. Love yourself for who you are and choose to be a healed individual that's happy with yourself like me. I'm happy with myself. Even all my things that hurt me and made me cry, feel like shit, I learned to. I learned that we know how to heal our selves and we use our smart mind to do this and our body we know how to do that now you guys and some girl wants you to be single so she's gonna keep trying to do shit to mess up your relationship somebody out here see they want you to be single see that see i'm married and these siblings and maybe an aunt and uncle or maybe someone you thought of was an aunt, an aunt and uncle maybe somebody you thought of as a brother they wanted you to be single, and that's why they try to keep messing up your relationship. See, it tells on them. See, it tells on them. And uh, they some man that only wanted you to stay broken hearted, hearted. He didn't care if you was happy or not. He wanted to keep keep doing this shit to you. Did you hear that? Who was it? You could even fight the law, and you would still win because they know you're special and you're very protected people are understanding this about somebody out here it says learn what your truth is please this is what we're telling the people now these peeps are wanting to apologize for all the lies that they spread on you they finally want to bring peace but you still have your guard up around these people and i would i'd keep my damn guard up i sure would 
Hang on, let's see. Let's see if it spells out what it wants to tell us. Who is these people? I'll let you guys know, okay? With Egyptian publishers, you guys. What what is what are what who is this person that didn't want to, us to become a leader? Who is this person spirit? Could you please tell us and I love you and I thank you. Would you please tell us? A U H. Who is that? G spell D Dog J D Q J D Didn't want you to be a, a success. Look how it shot out. It shot out just like this. J D somebody's initials. They didn't want you to be a success. Something about bag, B A G. What about bag? What about bag? Now, come on, tell truth about bag. V C H Q E M L L. Much. Much M U C H. I don't know what it means yet, you guys. Much V E L L. What are you trying to spell, Spirit? What is this mean down here? Throw out a bunch. P G. PG is my initials. files that's all we'll get are the O E Where's the I I I I I I'm not stand right out here. Alright so I got all the vowels out A O's and U's Okay now let's see what it's trying to spell Somebody hit truck, T-R-U-C-K. There's a bag in somebody's truck. Somebody might have, somebody might have hit a bag that has a much stuff in it in your truck. Are you listening? They're hot, trying to hide drugs in your, in your vehicle. I believe that's what it's talking about. Pay attention to me, you all. These men, M E N, they whatever men is coming up against you. It's they're trying to put a bag in your truck. Are you listening? Are you listening? P G. Yeah, I'm listening.
up. Spirit saying bye, be why. Bye to these people that was trying to have you nailed in, nailed to the cross, N A I L. Oh, bye to these men that was trying to have you nailed for drugs in your vehicle, cause I'm putting it out right now. It ain't my drugs, law. But they trying to do this to me. No, uh uh, I don't buy no drugs. Now, come on, law. spell what are you trying to spell spirit What's this? Me Q O L L coil coil call coil coil. Q O L L headquarters H Q headquarters H Q. Uh oh, sounds like the law call headquarters. SEO mm, What's this mean? S E O C H L Sichel Call Sichel Call C Seoshal. Call Seoshal. What's that mean? V8 headquarters. <coughs> Listen, PG. PG JD put a call into headquarters to to nail these men to the cross for trying to put a bag in your vehicle that's got a lot of drugs in it. That's what it's saying, bye. It says, bye, bye men, bye men that is trying to put much drugs your much drugs that's in a bag inside of my truck. Bye to you all. And JD put a call in to headquarters to to nail these men for PG. That's what it just said. Now, did you hear that, you guys? Y'all take from it what it is, because that's what it said, okay? And let me see who this reading was for. Who is this waiting for today, the spirit? I know I'm gonna put all these back. What do you want to tell us? This is my new tarot deck, you guys.
You're not in this feeling of defeat and loss anymore. You're not in this being feeling defeated. You sailed away. Look, you sailed away. You got in a boat and you sailed away. Six of Wands, you know. Uh, you, you, you're on a journey of self-healing. The star. I, I know it's hard to see, y'all, but it says the star. Can you see it now? And the star in this deck is using a Ouija board. I like this deck, this horror deck, because it is so cool. Like, they put a lot of intricate details. I love like that, don't you guys? And what else did y'all want to tell us about Spirit? Star, you had to uh, stand up for yourself and what you believed. And this is about you rising above all them obstacles. That's what it means. All these challenges that was thrown at you. you. You're rising above them, honey bunches. That's all it means. And uh, Knight of Pentacles. Uh, this got illuminated to you how it's this person that was moving slow towards you. They didn't. Hey, you know, they, 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 they was probably against you. That's why you said you was tired of waiting on her eyes and, uh, you know, fighting for this person. Uh, yeah, and then, it, and then it flipped out. Page of Wands upside down. See, Page of Wands upside down. Um, I need to see what that means in just a second. And then we got Four of Cups. Uh, they wanted you depressed and in apathy, and you're not. You sailed away from being like that. You moved away from it. You sailed away and moved away from it. Star. You're trying to have a victory and success. You know, you're, you're believing in your your path to spirituality and your hopes and wishes. That's what you're going after, you know. You you found that you don't need nobody on this path. Look, yeah, look. You, you turned and walked away from these people. And it looks like somebody's in a nightgown or, you know, something outside under the moonlight. And, you know, Star said, hell if this, I... I, I turn and walking away, and, and I'm part of all these challenges that I got through. Six of Wands is going to make me have a victory. Is is all it did is is now I have a victory. And this person that is going slow, the slowest moving in the deck, it got illuminated to you. See, Ace of Swords, uh, Werewolf hands. Uh, you gain gain truth and clarity that that person didn't really want you. you it was all ain't losing, you know, and this page of wands, it's, you know, upside down, a page of wands, that's about, you know, some young offer, like, to take action, but you know that you gain truth that this person wasn't never going to take action, they was very immature is what it is, and you, you said, uh, you went into hermit mode. Look at that scary house. <laughs> Ain't them cards pretty? I love you all. And um, you decided to work on all that shadow work. See that shadow in the in the window right there? You went inside. You did all your shadow work. It was healing. You know, and, and now you, you're you alchemizing this new path. You know, it's one that you're on. Uh, you're, you're, this is your journey. And maybe you use a crystal ball. What's the outcome? That you're an empress. That you've birthed this new business, you know, and and it's you, star. You're you're going to be a star because you walked away. Uh, you walked away, and it got illuminated to you about you know, my, maybe you self sacrificed yourself, or somebody sacrificed you that you was putting on a pedestal, you know, and you shouldn't have been doing that, and you got over that challenge, that's why you got victory and success, and, and, uh, three of pentacles, you know, this is talking about, you got, you had victory and success with this, uh, it came upside down, though, so it was with somebody in your community that, uh, you overcame, and they, they did you wrong, and, they, they pretended to be coming towards you, but they what? And you gained truth on it. And, and you 
you decided to go uh, do some rest and recouping for a sword, you know, you went inside and rested and you're uh, deciding to come out now, you know, from this rest and recoup and it going, you know, in hermiting mode, you know. And uh, now somebody wants to send you some messages or, or they're, they're getting messages that you're getting ready to come out and be a success. That's what it is. That's the truth. They, they, they're getting messages that is Star going to be a success for Will? Is Star, what's... Oh, it, they're going to get messages of why these people that betrayed you, Nine of Swords, you know, it's lie, cheat, betrayal. These people that backstabbed you stabbed you, maybe said you was a cheat and all this. Now, they're under judgment. Judgment's coming. They're going to have to be judged for all the choices and actions they made about you, Star. That's all it means. And, and you know, and, and you'll have to, and maybe you got to call judgment. Somebody's calling judgment to you, but right here's what it is, I think. Hang on. This person that uh, that fucked with you, karma's coming to get them, and it's upside down. This is Will Fortune. Karma will turn, and it's not in their luck. And it's a Queen of Pentacles. It's it's a married. See Queen of Pentacles upside down. That's a married mother that has a lot of spiritual and physical wealth, or she appears to have. And Queen of Cups is love. So this Queen of Pentacles was lying and acting like she loved you and it got illuminated that this person you thought of as an aunt was a Cancer, Scorpio or Pisces and it got illuminated to you that she really didn't give two shits about you. You know, and in spirit she's getting judged for it and she's worried that she's going to have to go to jail. That's what it is. Oh, uh, now she's feeling, uh, trapped. See how she's tied up and, like, trapped and all them swords is around her, you know? And she's got a, 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 a damn sword on her hand, cut the freaking rope and, or, or something, you know? But she, it's like she's closing her eyes to this. It's like she's lying and just closed her eyes about this. Uh, 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 going to this King of Pentacles around. Look how big that wire wolf is. That she went to this King of Pentacles and, and, and lied to you. That this was about <coughs> Karmic Wheels turning for this old King of Pen this Queen of Pentacles that was pouring out fake love and, and acting like they hadn't did nothing to this King of Pentacles and this star. And don't worry, her judgment's coming. She's going to have to go to jail. That's what it means. Gonna have to go to jail. Yep, she's gonna have to go to jail or something. That's what it is. That's what the judgment is. Well, I hope you guys liked how I did that, you guys. Uh, I hope y'all liked how I did it, you all. I appreciate y'all and I love you. I'm gonna go to bed. I'm tired, so I can get up tomorrow and try to give y'all. A better reading, okay? And I hope y'all like my cards. Uh, I like them. I, I appreciate them. I was going to read out a book, y'all, but I don't feel too well right now. Look at King of Wands. Look at old sneaker snake. Ten of Pentacles. It's ten, ten coffins. <laughs> they are cool, ain't they? All right, well, I hope I help somebody out here tonight. Peace, and I'll see you later. Bye.